Well, I don't know if that flash is a good idea. Can I turn it off? We'll keep, we'll just keep going. So hi, look at all that. That's really sparkly. <laughs> shiny, I mean, it's really shiny. Um, Ipsy bag, which I was expecting yesterday. Get out of the, okay, I'm having some struggles. There we go. Look at the cuteness, that's adorable. It's just solid on that side. Oh my God, it's a heart, it's a flippin' heart. Ipsy. Okay. So this is my Ipsy bag for the month of this month. What is this month? This month is, is it June? Yeah, it's June. Um, I don't know much about their promotion right now, but this, um, I assume has something to do with gay pride because that is this month. So, uh, colors. Yeah, does it say June, right? June? Yeah. Ipsy colors in June. Yep. So, um, I was interested in reading about it. And as far as that went, I didn't actually read anything about it. But there's something that's in bubble wrap in here. What are you? Funny thing is, I actually saw my preview, so I know everything that's in here, and I don't remember. Oh, this is eyeshadow, isn't it? This is eyeshadow. Jesus, one hand is a dumb idea. But, what are you? You are, what is it? Cream metallic foil shadow. Oh, with jojoba oil. I don't know how to pronounce that. Um, I remember reading about this. They tell you to apply it with your finger. And I assume because it won't have a very good effect if you don't. Come on, out of the box, out of the box. Doing this one handed because I was too anxious. Okay, let me explain the anxiousness. I was supposed to get this yesterday even after receiving my mail and everything, I still checked the mailbox like three times because I refused to believe that they were a day late because it said, said it was supposed to be here yesterday. I'm struggling. Okay. Go away. That's upside down. Look how pretty that is. Was that Sai? Say? Saya? Hi? I don't know. Is it, is it a click button? Will it pop open? No, I've used actual muscles. Jeez. Okay, anyway, so I was expecting this yesterday. And there's no way I'm opening this by myself. Okay, that. Jesus. Well, um, yeah, let's just, uh, we'll swatch that in a minute. Let's just keep going through the bag. Oh, yeah, so I just checked my mail. Like, just checked it. Um, Innisfree Intensive Hydrating Serum. Is this a facial item? Or is this a... I'm reading, so I can't talk. Face. Okay, so this is a serum for your face. Um, I couldn't tell. Because I've been getting a lot of hair products. Yeah. Um, I think I'm done with Birchbox, because at first I was okay with Birchbox being a lot of hair products, because I liked them, and now I just keep getting shampoo and conditioner, and I'm tired of it. Anywho, that was my rant on them. Oh my god, it's in a package! Mac! Oh, Jesus, I'm trying to tell y'all a story. And, yeah, so I was just so anxious and excited for this to come in. I checked my mailbox and then it wasn't there and I literally turn around and I watch him. Ooh, eye cream. I need an eye cream. And so I literally watch him walk up in my window. So I tried to be patient and wait for him to you know leave to not be the weird creepy person. Apparently I wasn't patient enough. And uh, <gasps> Oh my god, tragedy! I'm so scared. Okay, we're good. Nothing happened. Nothing bad happened. In case you're wondering, my legs is not a flat surface to do this on! <laughs> this is so many problems. 
Why did I open it? Why? 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 I just want to close it. I just want to close it. Close it. Okay. You got this. You got this. I could be one-handed. No, I can't. Anywho, so I opened the door on the mailman, like a weirdo, and so he, um, what did he do? He handed me my mail and then pulled this out of the mailbox and said, well, here you go. Oh, there's my dumb story I was trying to tell you. This is eyeliner, and this one had a color option. So I've seen this happen, like, three times, where they will offer you a product, and you won't know what color you're getting until you receive it. So this was either whiskey or blue, I think, was the other color. And my luck is that I'm getting whiskey and I want the bluey purple shade. Open. Okay. This is not. No one wants to sit here and watch me struggle with this. Okay. <laughs> I'll be back. Hold on. Okay. So I am back. I'm struggling with the camera. Why are we shaking? So, um, the other two options, or the other two items were, like, facial options, which I can't really swatch for you, but, uh, so I swatched. The top blue is the eyeliner. Focus. There we go. And then the middle creamy is that lip gloss, um, titled See Through. And then that shimmery flakiness it's interesting because it provides little to no color, but it definitely puts like a glitter almost. It's like a flaky. There's really no real color. I mean, just a tiny bit of color. Let me play with it just a little bit more because, I mean, it's pretty. I mean, look at that. You have an actual color in the pots. And I can't see anything on my hand, so that bothers me. Hold on. I'm going to play around. Okay, here we go. So, I drew on my other hand. And there's the eyeliner again. So, little flakies do have color. So, it'll cover up... When shined, it'll cover up the color behind it. So, I'll just have to play with it. Kids in the background, if you can hear them, playing outside, summer. And for, um, for, for shits and giggles, I'm just going to go ahead and grab my Burt's box, because I got that yesterday, or the day before. Okay, so here's the two boxes, and, um, just as a recap, out of Ipsy, we got an eye cream, which I am quite excited about. I don't have... I don't have any eye creams in my collection right now. Um, a serum. That's a that's kind of a lot. I mean, it is a sample size, but this is, you know, a fair amount for serum. I was going to open it and try and smell it, but I'm not going to. Uh, they gave me the lip gloss, the MAC lip gloss in shade see-through. The, what brand are you? Um, it says Beauty for Real, and the shade is In the Navy. Can you read that? In the Navy. Yeah, this is that blue color. And then... We ah! <laughs> and then we've got this... Um, say? Sai? I keep saying shy, but that is not right at all. The S and the H are not together. Um, this color, it has that nice flaky peel. I'll probably love this. When I play around with it and put it with actual eyeshadows, I'll probably love this. It's on the back of my hand, not so much. Um, so that came with the Ipsy. Lately, Bert has been sending me, like, extra items, but there's hair care. So, no, there's only, there's only five in here. Um, but I got two decent-sized little bottles of shampoo and conditioner from Apothecare essentials and I like these better than the ones they sent me last time last month they sent me shampoo and conditioner as a free samples like extra samples and then I got like the matching hair oil and I hate the smell 
it's like, I don't remember the brand. So I tried these last night. I like it. Um, but I don't like it any more than the stuff I buy at Walgreens. <laughs> um, they gave me a face cream, Kiehl's Ultra Facial Oil Free Gel Cream. So this is a cream. Um, I generally use lotions, so this will be more hydrating in general. And then more flippin' mascara. Um, Marcello? Marcelli? I don't know. Extension plus curl. So this is a curling mascara. And I, I don't know, maybe I should try it out. But I have so many mascaras that I'm not even opening them anymore. And then this, I actually kind of like this, but I have yet to use it. Um, was it Glow, Glow Nation? Glow, Glotion? Yeah, so this is actually really pretty. Ooh, here we go. He has a really subtle, um, shimmer. And, like, it's a lotion. And here we go. And it says you can put it underneath your foundation or on top of your foundation, and I feel like my foundation will cover that up. But, you know, it's just it's another highlighter. And I like it. it. It's, you know, it's sparkly without being glittery. Yeah, so visually, to see the difference between bo uh, botch, Birch and Ipsy. Hair care. Facials. Like, um, cut, whatever. And then these are the only two makeup items, and the one in here could be duped as a as a lotion as well. So I'm getting like one real item of makeup and it's mascara. Over here, yes, I, I have two face products, but then I have like three items of makeup. And the whole hair care situation is why a friend of mine left Birch and it's why I didn't put the effort in to re-sign up. And went like four or five months without getting Birchbox, and then they just started up again. Like I didn't, I didn't request it. I didn't put the effort in. I don't know why it started back up again because I already reached my year subscription. But I wasn't too upset about it. It's ten bucks a month, and I get free, free stuff. I get stuff, but I'm tired of the mascara, and I'm tired of getting hair care products. I'm good. I, I, I'm done. So I think I'm going to officially stop the birch box. And I'm having too much fun with Ipsy, but I'll probably join my friend on the boxy charm train. <laughs> that one you get full size items. So right now I'm currently paying twenty dollars a month for my two boxes. Or I could pay twenty dollars a month to get full size items. So yeah. I'm rambling. I hope you guys enjoyed. This is kind of a little side-by-side -side comparison of what is going on. And to clarify, I went through and changed my what I what I preferenced, and I took hair care items off entirely. And like I still still got that two months in a row. I got shampoo and conditioner sets. Anywho, so starting to not like birch right now but i'm still enjoying my ipsy and i will see you guys later bye bye